Dear student, welcome back. Today we will describe about mathematics learning design from 1 to 15. This is our part 1. Remaining part you will get from our playlist. So let's start today's video. At first you see here guide certificate. Therefore acknowledgement Next, you have to include it, the page where writing mathematics learning design English version. Therefore, next page is theory. So, we write here theoretical part what is learning design? Therefore, importance of learning design. Next, types of learning design. Next, characteristics of learning design. Next, quality of good learning design. Here, we writing quality of good learning design. Next, we have reached our practical portion that is here we writing how writing the learning design from mathematics various content area. First learning design taken from class 6. Learning goals or objective are remembering, understanding, applying, analyzing, therefore evaluating, creating. Next, analyze learner and context. From previous knowledge, we have to question this one, two, three. Next point is develop and select learning materials. Therefore, learning strategy. This point divided into two parts, learning areas and related strategies. Therefore, design for evaluation. After completing learning strategy, you have to question students. So, we have included two questions for evaluation. Therefore, our last point of the learning design is diagnosing the weakness for remedial class. If any necessity, teacher will diagnose the weakness after evaluation. We have reached our learning design number two. This is taken from class 6 and today lesson is number 1 that is multiplication of a fraction by a whole number or by a fraction. Learning goals are remembering, understanding, applying, analyzing, evaluating, creating. Next point is analyze learner and context. Number C or next point is develop and select learning materials therefore learning strategy which is divided into two parts, learning areas and related strategy. Learning areas included concept of multiplying a fraction by a whole number, principle of solving problems. Next, design for evaluation. For evaluating, we have included six questions, number one, multiply two and three by four, etc. Next, diagonizing the weakness for remedial class, if any. We have reached our third number learning design from class 6 and today lesson is number subunit 2 dividing a fraction by a whole number or a by a fraction. Learning goals are remembering, understanding, applying, analyzing, evaluating, creating. Therefore, develop and select learning materials, learning strategy. Design for evaluation, diagnosing the weakness. Next, learning design number 4, taken from class 6 and today lesson is concept of point and ray. The learning goals or objective of this learning design are remembering, understanding, applying, analyzing, evaluating, creating. Therefore, next point is analyze learner and context. Therefore, 
develop and select learning materials and then learning strategy this is most important point of this learning design next point is design for evaluation and last diagnosing the weakness for remedial class next learning design number five which is taken from class six and today lesson is concept of line and segment learning goals are remembering understanding applying analyzing evaluating creating next point is analyze learner and context therefore develop and select learning materials learning strategy which is divided into two parts learning areas and related strategies learning areas are included concept of the line and line segment properties of line and line segment therefore design for evaluation and last point is diagnosing the weakness for remedial class next learning design number six which is taken from class six and today lesson is finding the square root of fractions learning goals are student will able to remembering understanding applying analyzing evaluating and creating therefore next point is analyze learner and context for analyzing the previous knowledge of student uh, you have to question this next number c develop and select learning materials learning strategy therefore design for evaluation diagnosing the weakness for remedial class if any therefore design for evaluation learning design number 7 learning goals or objective are remembering understanding applying analyzing evaluating creating next learning design number 8 which is taken from class 7 concept of con uh, congruency of triangles analyze learner and context develop select and learning materials learning strategy therefore evaluation and last diagonal the weakness next learning design number nine from class seven and today lesson is subunit two that is concept of uh, interrelation uh, interrelationship between each pair of the uh, vertically opposite angle the alternate angle the corresponding angle and the uh, co interior angle formed by a transversal intersecting of two parallel straight lines next learning goals or objective are remembering understanding applying analyzing evaluating creating therefore next point is analyze learner and context develop and select learning materials learning strategy therefore design for evaluation diagnosing the weakness and therefore learning design number 10 understanding applying analyzing evaluating creating next point is analyze learner and context develop and select learning materials learning strategy next design for evaluation next learning design number 11 from class 8 and today lesson is characteristics of frequency distribution the learning goals or objective of this learning design are student will able to remembering understanding applying analyzing evaluating and creating therefore next point is analyze learner and context therefore develop and select learning materials learning strategy and therefore design for evaluation and last diagonizing the weakness we have reached our learning design number 12 and this is taken from class 8 which is today lesson uh, subunit 1 that is concept of graph and its axis learning goals are remembering understanding applying analyzing evaluating creating analyze learner and context next develop and select learning materials therefore learning strategy which is most important point from uh, any learning design therefore design for evaluation next learning design number 13 which is taken from class 8 and uh, today lesson subunit 2 that is graph pointing and joining them 
after today's lesson student will be able to remembering understanding applying analyzing evaluating and creating therefore analyze learner and context develop and select learning materials learning strategy learning uh, which is divided into two equal parts learning areas and related strategy learning areas are included for concept of graph pointing principle governing graph pointing and joining them therefore design for evaluation next point is diagnosing the weakness for remedial class we have reached our learning design number 14 which is taken from class number uh, class 8 and today lesson is subunit 2 that is construction of pi diagram so the learning design have objectives uh, remembering understanding applying analyzing evaluating creating therefore next point is analyze learner and context next point is develop and select learning materials therefore learning strategy which is divided into two parts learning areas and related strategy learning areas at first we have in writing concept of pi diagram therefore design for evaluation uh, you may uh, writing here some uh, question from prior diagram therefore diagnosing the weakness next we have reached our last learning design of this video next part we included in part 2 this learning design taken from class 8 and today lesson is marked um, uh, number 1 area of rectangle learning goals are objective are remembering understanding applying analyzing evaluating creating therefore analyze learner and context next develop and select learning materials therefore learning strategy next design for evaluation and diagnosing the weakness so thank you for watching this video in the next part we will discuss about from learning design number 16 to 30 thank you everyone